With scheduled flights suspended, many foreigners and Afghans are stranded. The U.S. and other countries are rushing to evacuate staff and others. On Sunday, the Taliban declared victory after Afghan President Ashraf Ghani fled abroad and his government collapsed. We congratulate the great victory to the whole Afghan nation, especially to the people of Kabul and to our Mujahideens. The way we have come through was unexpected as we have reached the position which was never expected. But with the help of Allah, that he has given us the victory and there is nothing like this in history of the world, so we should thank Allah. The militants return to rule brings an end to almost 20 years of a U.S.-led coalition presence in the country. Kabul was the last major city in Afghanistan to hold out against a Taliban offensive that began months ago but accelerated in recent days as they gained control of territories, shocking many observers. The Islamist group was able to seize control after most foreign troops pulled out. Following the Taliban seizure of Kabul, many people headed to the airport. Evacuations of foreigners and some Afghans with links to foreign governments and organizations have been taking place, but passengers said rumors spread that even those without visas were being allowed to travel. As huge crowds gathered, U.S. forces reportedly fired into the air to disperse people who were trying to force their way onto the planes. There were reports that some died in the stand. At the weekend, U.S. President Joe Biden defended the withdrawal of American troops, saying he could not justify The Taliban, U.S. Army says soldiers shot two armed men while three people are reportedly dead. This was after falling from the underside of the plane they were clinging onto shortly after takeoff. All flights have now stopped as soldiers try to clear the runways. The United States and other countries are rushing to evacuate staff and allies. On Sunday, the Taliban declared victory after Afghan President Ashraf Ghani fled abroad and his government